Time now for Eyewitness News. Call 12 for action. The safety of child car seats in side impact crashes is about to be put to the test. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration is proposing new standards it says will save children's lives and prevent injuries. Problem solver Susan Hogan joins us now with the details. Well, when we strap our children into their car seats, we assume they're going to protect them in a crash. While car seat manufacturers claim they are safe, they're now being asked to prove it. Sarah Blout has felt the impact of a side collision. 15 years ago, she was behind the wheel with her nephew in a car seat when another driver ran a stop sign. And it was terrifying, <laughs> you know, and he was fine, but to, he was asleep and then the accident woke him up. The expecting mother of two welcomes new standards that would make child car seats safer in side impact crashes. Many seats on the market claim they are safe in side collisions. Now the government wants them to prove it. The National Highway Traffic and Safety Administration is really more interested in just how the car seats react in a car crash, not so much the specific vehicle. We've done a lot of work to protect children in frontal crashes with existing standards, but the one area where we haven't yet addressed is the side impact crash. Under the proposed standards, the new seats would have to protect the child's head from the car's door being crushed in a side impact accident. The impact of that crash could sadly send their head into the door and cause serious injury. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration plans to use a specially designed test with child-sized dummies to see which seats meet the standards. You want to know every time you drive your car, to, your kids to the grocery store or school, that, that they're going to be safe. Um, and as a parent, that's your number one concern. Once the new rules are in place, car seat makers will have three years to comply. Now, the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration says the new rules will save five children's lives and prevent 64 injuries a year. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228-1850. Or if you're interested in becoming a Call 12 for Action volunteer with me, you can call that same number you see right there on your screen. I'm problem solver Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.